The oyster population in the Chesapeake Bay is on the rise, and this is great news according to activists who say oysters are instrumental for a healthy environment, but advocates say there is still a lot of work to do. Emily Harrison has a story. When you think of the Chesapeake Bay, your initial thought might not be oysters, but it should be at least one of them, as a single oyster reef represents $40,000 of annual economic benefit, according to Chris Moore, the executive director of the Chesapeake Bay Foundation. You know, oysters are so important both to the economy and the ecology of the Hampton Roads region and the Chesapeake Bay region as a whole. In a newly released report, the Chesapeake Bay Foundation found the oyster population is finally rebounding thanks to several conservation efforts as oysters have been overharvested for decades. If you go back even into the late 1800s when we had a very robust oyster fishery, we were probably overfishing oysters at that time and the, and the population started to go on a downward trend. Moore says while they are celebrating their achievements in oyster growth, the work isn't done. The next step is looking into fishery practices. Uh, both Virginia and Maryland have very historic um, wild oyster harvest fisheries, um, but we have new tools out there in order to help modernize the science around those. We want to make sure this decision making around those is something that's open and transparent. Once that is accomplished, Moore says Virginia will truly be a pioneer in reclaiming our water and wetland environments. He says his organization will be sending several recommendations to the General Assembly to make sure this happens. Emily Harrison, 13 News Now.